Okay guys, taking a look at a 75,000 BTU furnace. Uh, got a pressure switch that's failing on this. It's about 15 years old. Uh, it's been happening for quite some time. Um, you know, we'll cycle on and off. And uh, we are looking at replacement of this. The uh, shoot the coil, looks like that's all done at the same time. Um, and then uh, looking at uh, adding in our five inch filter. So we got room seven inches right there to do that. Return is the correct size. It's actually 10 by 24, and that's okay there. Um, and then flue piping, I'm saying the back's hard to can, so flue piping runs up, comes over and hits B vent right in this corner. Gas lines uh, a pretty easy fix. And new drain piping hits the floor drain just right over here. Uh, the only thing I would say as far as this modifying the electric and gas, I don't know that we'll be able to get onto a uh, onto a base without doing something different with the coil. Um, so I'll uh, keep that in mind. Uh, they do have combustion air vents high, uh, and there's actually one there. New return. Uh, there was about four, three or four registers added to the basement. The basement was just done a few months ago. Um, no problems uh, with heating because of that. It's just been a, a pressure switch issue. Uh, so we'll have to have you know this area cleared out and uh, some things along the front cleared out before we start our work. I'll let the homeowner know that. Um, there is no walkout, I don't believe. We'll just have to come down the steps and hit the furnace.